Are you having a hard time playing your favorite Roblox game and getting the 260 error code? If you are, go through the list of solutions in this video to see which one will help you fix it. Method 1. Verify your account is not banned. Before you start tinkering with your device, the very first thing that you should need is to ensure that your account is OK. Your Roblox account can be moderated or banned depending on the offense you've committed. Sometimes, the ban is short and temporary ranging from one day to two weeks. At times, an account may be permanently banned, which means that the Roblox system has already closed it and can no longer be opened. If you are getting any message about your account being moderated or banned, we suggest that you contact Roblox Appeals team using this form. Method 2. Allow Roblox in your firewall or security software. If you are positive that your account is working and not blocked from playing online, the next good thing that you can do is to ensure that your firewall, antivirus, or malware protection software is not blocking you from connecting to a game host. Open the control panel. Select System and Security. Select Allow an app through Windows Firewall. Select Change Settings found on the upper right corner of the screen. Click Allow another app. Select Browse. Select Roblox application. Click Add and ensure that the check mark is found on the box for Roblox to be successfully added. Launch Roblox to check if the software is working properly after the changes are made. Method 3. Check for Login Glitch. Some Roblox players in the past encountered a login glitch with the platform they're using. To fix the issue, you can try to log into your account using a different device. So, for example, if you are mainly playing on your Windows computer, try logging into your Roblox account using another browser, or by using the smartphone version of Roblox. Method 4. Power Cycle Router. You can reboot the router by unplugging it from the power source for about 30 seconds. Afterwards, turn it back on, wait for the lights to be stable, and connect to your Roblox game again. Method 5. Check for slow or intermittent connection problems. The other troubleshooting step that you can do is to see if you have slow or intermittent connection problems. On the device you're using to play Roblox, do a speed test and see if your connection speed is good enough. On mobile, I was able to personally play without problems with 5 megabit per second. I haven't tried playing anything slower than that so I don't know how the game works below that speed. Another thing that you must consider is if your internet is constantly or randomly disconnecting. If you have this problem, your device will not be able to maintain a solid connection to the server and may eventually stop working. Method 6. Disable VPN. If you are using a VPN, it's possible that the root of your current connection is not ideal for online gaming. Consider changing the VPN server you're using to improve the speed, or simply turn it off. Method 7. Check your signal interference. Wireless connection is less reliable than a wired setup. If you play on a PC, try to connect it directly to the router with a LAN cable and see if that will improve the situation. Method 8. Open proper ports. Roblox uses a certain port range on your computer. If these ports are blocked, you will encounter issues connecting to the server. Exact ports vary depending on the operating system version you're using. Right now, UT 49152-65535 is the ports that Roblox uses. Method 9. Delete and reinstall Roblox. If none of the solutions in this guide have helped in fixing the Roblox error code 260, you can delete and reinstall the game.